this is going to be released at some point, like, near after this video, for sure. Because I want to get out there while they're, while they're doing this right now. Where they're dropping two songs at a time, the day of. And I want to get that out there with the reactors because they, I want to flood the, flood it all. Might post this a little later. Um, this is Sleep Token. They're back at it again. This band has become one of my favorite in recent weeks with their newer stuff they are putting out. Prefer the 2019 album over 2021, but that's their older stuff. This is the new stuff, and this is what you want. You want to evolve in door. You want that new sound. You want to see where they take it, and they're taking it to a new stratosphere. They're going to be the band of this year, most likely, for the metalcore level. Deathcore is a different story. Still looking for that band. But this is going to be that metalcore, post-hardcore post sound where you get that, just that band that comes out of nowhere. This is their year. Aqua, Radia, Sleep Token.
2023 is their year. Yeah, for sure. For sure. 2023 is going to be their year. All other releases are going to come second fiddle to that. All other releases now are going to come second fiddle to that. For sure. Because no, no song sounds the same. Exactly. And no song but the motifs spreading through this possible album are there. And where it's spreading... Going from song to song, I never recorded anything for Chokeholder, The Summoning. I don't even know the order of the songs. Because I'm not going to take the order face value from a Discord. And that, 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 that's everything you want from music is the unknown. You don't want the predictability. You want the changes. You want the switch ups. You want it all. And Sleep Token is going to give it to us this year. <laughs>